Tell me everything you know about food. Well, that's good. So why do you need to learn more? I don't need to learn about food. Oh, then why are we going to this silly thing? We're going to this Indigo because Chef Michael Smith is going to be here. Who? He's a chef from the Michael food Network. Michael W. Smith? He's a Food Network star. <laughs> okay. It's windy. I love the Food Network. The, yeah, the audio quality is not great right now. Autumn. The season doesn't make it more or less windy. Yes, it does. No, it doesn't. Yes, it does. That's not it's how the environment works. In August. No, in August? It's autumn. To that, make the that's not fall true. Off the trees. No. Yes! It's a defining characteristic of the season. No, it's not. Yes, it is. He's talking. I don't even know what he's going to be talking about. Food. Probably. He's, he's Canadian? I take Emerald's books and put them down. <laughs> Corey and I have been out shopping all day. We've been to like five different stores trying to get stuff for the house. And they don't really like when you film inside stores. We bought some garbage cans, which is super exciting. We're looking for a new shelving for the bathroom since the last one fell off the wall. I'm vlogging by myself in a car. People probably think I'm really weird. Someone parked beside me. And they were looking. So then I pulled out my phone to make it look like I was doing something else and distract from the giant camera sitting on the dashboard. There's water on our floor. Pour some water. There's just water. Just that looks like coffee to me. Yeah. Corrado. Well, that Corrado is ball. water. Water. We need bubble bath Why? because I'm shooting a video in which bubbles are going to come to life. Something really scented. Oh, you should get something that smells like fall. Get bubble bath that smells like fall. Yeah. <laughs> Dude, look at me, I'm a grown up. <laughs> you know what I bought? Candy. Looks like a face. Looks like a very unimpressed face. You're the best videographer ever, Matchy. Uh, no, no. Da 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 <laughs> Whenever I'm thirsty, I generally grab the first thing in the fridge. And because I drink, I drink water. a lot of monster, I usually grab one of those instead of yeah. water. Sometimes I spill on my crotch as well. There needs to be more bubbles from here. Yeah. Oh yeah, there's gonna be. I'm draining it and I'm gonna put all of this open. We're gonna look to laugh. Together. If there's no humor and none of us are laughing, then it's easier to get into like a more serious character, more serious role. Both you guys are working on special effects right now, right? Yeah. It's gonna be awesome. Ethan's trying to open every cupboard at once. So you have some paranormal activity stuff going on where he just pulls on it and all the cupboards fly open. Right. And I'm going to try to have footsteps appear down the hallway, but they're foam because the bathroom overflows with foam. Is Jimmy yelling? Yeah. Hold on. What does he want? What do you want? This is in no way set up. This bathroom doesn't work. The toilet, the water is actually down there and has been turned off. But what? somehow... <gasps> what is that? Somehow it filled what? with bubbles from upstairs. That's no way. hilarious. I think maybe Matt G is pulling a prank on us or something. How would Matt do that? With soap. It really is. How does he, but there's no water in there. How would he make the bubbles? This is messed up. Did you pull a prank on us? No. I didn't do that. <laughs> Are you sure? I went to the bathroom in it and then I couldn't flush it. The toilet is filled with bubbles. I didn't do anything. Did you pee bubbles? I was drinking some dish soap earlier. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't do that. Did you try flushing it? You... Oh, <laughs> it's the toilet's not on. There's only one answer. Poltergeist. We have to leave. We have to leave. Before the TV starts turning on and off. Doesn't the poltergeist usually make the walls bleed, not the toilet bubble? <laughs> Canadian poltergeist. They don't, they're not very threatening. They're like, oh, do you want some more bubbles? Here's some bubbles in your toilet. What great poltergeist we have. They're probably going to apologize later. What are you doing? <laughs> we have to have uh, wet footprints in the hallway. The best way to do wet footprints is wet feet, but feet don't hold much as much moisture as socks. So I'm going to I'm stepping in water to soak my socks to then walk down the hallway. That's just so against It feels what so do. weird. So weird. Action.
Perfect. Yeah. So. Hey Matt. Yeah? What's up? I'm in Corey's room. <gasps>